Hey guys, welcome back to Harry Potter. Um, hmm, do we go that way? Yes. No, wait, no, no, we don't. We don't need to go that way yet. We can, we'll go there later. Come on, load. Edwig will show us where to go, but I don't know where to go. Here's Neville. Harry, I've missed Herbology, and Professor Sprout's going to be really angry. Hello, Neville. What happened? I got lost, and ended up coming out this wall behind me. It must be a secret passage. This big one, I'll show you that too. What it puts up for that later. See this big one? You need to depend on it. It gets all pissed off and then comes and goes after you. But then it turns back to normal soon. Um, yeah, that's it. And the Hedwig has given as another letter for us. Harry, I'm still waiting for you to attend Quidditch training. Meet me at the Quidditch training pitch across the bridge from Hogwarts' main entrance. Oliver Wood. We will just send you that exact same letter until you go to the um, Quidditch pitch. Hello again, Potter. I'm still trying to get into the Quidditch team. Maybe this year I'll have some luck. Could you mention me to Oliver Wood? You are the Gryffindor seeker after all. Uh, no I will not, Dean. I've got important stuff to do. <coughs> Alright, Harry. Grab your broomstick and we'll begin the training. Oliver Wood replaces Madame Hooch in this Welcome game. Welcome to Quidditch training. In a Quidditch match, whichever seeker catches the golden snitch scores their team 150 points. Which is why seekers tend to get fouled so much, and also why we need to keep training. First off, we're going to practice your basic broom controls on a special training broom. This broom won't let you fly far from the ground, so we can concentrate on practicing your steering. Steer left and right to fly between the poles and use the X button to speed up. Try and finish the course before my stopwatch counts down. Get set. Three, two, one. Fly through the poles, Harry. Uh, oh. oh, sorry guys. Um, hang on, I'll be back. The emulator's glitching out. Concentrate. Yeah, oh, it's fixed. I got it fixed. Good work. Keep it up. I don't know what it was. I could, I couldn't turn Good or work. keep it up. Yeah, I couldn't move Harry at all. I don't know what was happening. That's it, Harry. I think I might have to redo this one. That's good. Not bad at all, Potter. 
For that performance, you've earned bronze wings. You'll have to do that one again. Right, Harry. Now we're going to move on to the next stage. I've got two broomsticks to choose from. You should try them both out to see which one you prefer. Here's the first one. Try it out by flying through these rings. Some people prefer the up and down controls the other way around. This second broom will let you try with these controls. Do you want to try them again? No. So Harry, which one did you prefer? If you decide broom. to change controls later, you can do so from the options screen. You've completed basic Quidditch training and now can play in the Quidditch League. Let's continue on to the advanced training. You've completed basic Quidditch training. Would you like to quit? No. Okay, now let's practice chasing the snitch. The training broom will now let you fly up and down. For the first part of your seeker training, let's see if you can fly through 10 hoops generated by the snitch. Get ready, Potter. Three, two, one. Release the snitch, Colin. Whoa, there's two Collins. Holy shit. Ha <laughs> ha, what a glitch. Fly That's never happened before. Down. So it must be a bug on the um, American version. That's good. That's it, Harry. That's good. Try harder. Nice one. Fuck! For that performance, you've earned silver wings. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do all these again. Because I'm pretty much failing this. Well, Time for your second seeker training well, lesson. The first one was you seem to fault. have gotten the hang of chasing the snitch. Let's see if you're any good at catching it. Fly through 10 rings, then move your hand over the snitch and hit the X button when it appears on screen. On my mark. 3, 2, 1. Dude, it is harder to catch Fly the snitch in this game. Time. I wanted to try something different, but it didn't work. It made, they made it harder. That's it, Harry. That's good. That's it, Harry. Huh, Brilliant. First time. For that performance, you've earned your gold wings and 25 house points for Gryffindor. In a Quidditch match, whichever team's seeker catches the golden snitch scores 150 points for their team. This often results in that seeker's team winning the match. Let's see how you manage catching a snitch whilst racing against another seeker. And now the random male Ready? Raven claw seeker Three, again. Two, one. I have no idea who that is. The rings, Good work. Keep it up. That's it, Harry. That's good. That's it, Harry. Good work. Keep it up. Good work. Keep it up. Keep it up. That's it, Harry. Oh. Concentrate. If you miss a ring, Harry, don't worry. Just keep going for the next one. That's it, Harry. That's good. Good work. Keep it up. That's it, Harry. Good work. Keep it up. If you miss a ring, Harry, don't worry. Just keep going for the next one. I seem to play better when I'm not talking. So yeah, I'll we'll, um do it again. Oh. What? There. Excellent. For oh, that, that performance, was... you've earned your gold How was that gold? Oh, I don't understand Griffin that. Door. That's Good it. session, Harry. The Quidditch training doors are always open for you. Yeah, we'll retry. Retry that. But I'll, I'll, I'll do it. I won't do it through the recording. I'll um, stop recording and do it and then start again. Hey, Harry! Fancy a bit of dueling practice? I don't know. 
Do you think it's a good idea? Oh, it's two Harrys! Yeah, why oh not? my god! I've beaten Fred before, you know. Anyway, if you're going to win against all the Founders champions, you need to practice. That's true. How about here then? This looks good. Let's say the path divides us, so it's like a proper arena. You can't cross it, and neither can I. Remember, Harry, you cast knockback jinxes in the same way you usually do with the X button, but special jinxes are cast using the circle button. And look! Those flowers are sparkling, so that means they'll have special jinxes hidden inside them. Right, let's go. Get ready, Jewel. This is rather embarrassing, but I um, actually lost against Ron once. That's round one to you. Get ready, Jewel. I reckon you could beat nearly anyone now. Have you heard that Slytherin have a new seeker? I wonder who it could be. It's me. And look at what my father has brought the whole Slytherin team. Very latest model. Only came out last month. I believe it considerably outstrips the old 2000 series. At least no one on the Gryffindor team had to buy their way in. Mm. No one asked your opinion, you filthy little mudblood. Malfoy! You'll pay for that, Malfoy! Ron, are you alright? I don't feel so good. <laughs> Ron, you'd better get to Hagrid's quick. Follow Ron, Harry, and don't let him out of your sight. There's three. Ah, oh, it's the one in the dungeons that's um, two, only two areas. Don't go up the slippery slope there. You uh, lose Ron. This 
way there's a Hagrid's. You can't explore that area. The area is randomly gone. <coughs> when you see Hagrid's hut. Right, Harry. We gotta let these slugs. Oh my run God! He still got that picture I'll give you of the bowl to catch them in. Move the bowl and run to catch them. Try and empty the slugs into the barrel as often as you can using the square button, or it'll overflow. Hurry up, Harry. Good luck. This is weird, because look. Slugs turn into, like, disgusting little things. And then they turn back into slugs again. I don't understand it. Well done, Harry. That was a great effort. <coughs> How are you feeling, Ron? A short Ron's oh, mouth is I never want to see another slug as long it. as I live. Next time I'll get Malfoy for sure. How can he call Hermione a mudblood? Ron, it's only a word. Yeah, but that well, was the most insulting thing he could Hermione think of. Hermione was crying in the movie. Mudblood is a really Malfoy unpleasant name for someone whose parents are non-magical. It's like in this game, there she are some care. Wizards who think they are better than everyone else because they're pure blood. Thanks for defending me, Ron. Especially the way your wand's been behaving. Is that really Yuck. a wand? How they change it? I can still taste the slugs. I think I need to go and brush my teeth again. Gosh, look at the time. We'd better get to Professor Lockhart's defense against the Dark Arts class. Yeah. Do we have to? Really, Harry? I don't know what you've got against Professor Lockhart. He's a fantastic teacher. Well, he seems to think so. <laughs> defense against the Dark Arts can be found in the Upper Castle. I'll show you the way, Harry. Yeah, all the, all the girls love Lockhart, but all the boys hate him. Alright, this... Um... This one, you also need Vertimilius, so don't go through it. Um, when I finish this part, I will go redo the um, Quidditch things to get all gold wings and not the um, house points. Yeah, and this is the upper castle. It's completely changed since the last game as well. A, a blonde Slytherin. I've actually, you actually, I've never actually seen a blonde Slytherin before, so that is really weird. Another blonde Slytherin. <laughs> They're everywhere. Okay, um, it's, nope, nothing here. I think it's 800. What was that noise? I think it's um 800 beans you need for the special. This should be a really thing. interesting lesson. Professor Lockhart is probably the bravest wizard who's ever lived. Is that why you've marked all Lockhart's lesson with little hearts on your timetable? <laughs> I have not. Are you okay, yeah, of Harry? Of course you haven't. I'm Marty. fine. Come on, let's go. Um, this isn't a secret passage, it's the, we, you come out here with the lessons over. This is the one that is a secret passage. This one has a card. Oh, you need a...
we're outside again. Oh no, this is the very, very top of Hogwarts. The other area must have been like another outdoor area. Here's the card. I oh, nearly got 200 beans. Jasunda Sykes. Jasunda Sykes. Uh. Oh yeah, the other woman who threw across Atlantic on a broomstick. Harry Potter. The Ignatius Gret Rowena Jason Dorf Jasunda Sykes. First person to fly across the Atlantic on a broomstick. Yeah, we got to get out of here. Whoops. <coughs> yeah, the rest of this part is just going to be um, exploring the upper castle. Fifteen cards. All right, you can go either way, but I'll go to this one first, which is the knight's room. to that single passage later. Go to Professor Dumbledore's office. And look how high this is. He's an old man and he, he has an office this high up in the castle. Like usual, his office is always locked. Now we'll go into this secret passage. This one you don't need, Vertimilius. I think this one's just beans. How bloody dangerous is this? So I'm gonna get killed from this. Well, okay. I don't know why he did Harry didn't jump. Yes! <sighs> what? Okay, what, what, what was that? like a tiny area so I don't know it, it, no reason for it to have a loading screen <laughs> so I can make it oh yeah sure this one, yeah, this one definitely has a card. Look, 
got that bane. If there's one on this side, yep. I'll go up here first. See what's up here. Oh, no, 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 no. Go through here first. Thing is open. Whoops. I'm so low on health. Oh, I, I had a glitch here once. Um, I went flying and look. Okay, I fell through right here when. When I was landing, I fell right through the floor here, and then I had to reset, restart this whole, um, this whole, uh, area. So I only got that glitch once, and I never got it again. I'm not really sure why it, why that happened, actually. I, I didn't really do anything stupid, I just, um landed on the air thing doing what it's meant to and yeah it just fell right through for some reason Cassandra Vablatsky oh Cassandra Vablatsky she is the author of Unfogging the Future Harry Potter the Greg Rowena Ray Jacinda Dorcas Yardley Helga Huff Chauncey Old Cassandra Vablatsky celebrated seer and author of Unfogging the Future Yeah, the night's room is done. Now we'll go to the other area, which is called the gallery. See like a little room down there with a the picture frame. I think up, up, up there is where Dumbledore's office is, where we just were. There's a card in here, I think. Oh no, when the game loads. Uh, yes, there is a card. Nintendo! 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 I'm just checking around if there's any. Beans. Nintendo. Nintendo. <laughs> oh, that was close. It's real easy to miss that and fall down. I've done it a few times. Is it? It's a really tiny platform. Where's the card? Uh, Adalbert Waffling. Adalbert Waffling. Hmm. Who was he again? Can't even cover him. Harry Potter. Ign Felix Greta. Rowena. Jacinda. Dorcas. Yardley. Pl Helga. H Adalbert Waffling. 
famous magical theoretician. Hmm, I actually don't remember him. Hey, there's Peeves! Not finished the gallery yet. This door is always locked. It's um, it's just says no entry to fl uh, no entry due to flooding, Mr. Filch. See, that never opens. And this is Moaning Myrtle's bathroom, which we we go in there sometimes. Late later on in the game, there's a random. Gryffindor students, which we can't talk to. We can't talk to anyone in the PS1 games. Whoa, Hedwig! Calm down, you're gonna kill yourself. It's too early to die. Well, <laughs> that's actually kind of mean. Um, alright, here's Defense Get Dark Arts. Okay, in the next part, we will, I uh, would have the Quidditch training done, and... We'll do Defense Against the Dark Hearts, so... Oh, sorry, see you then, bye.